welcome it is time for the Pisces it is the last week oh Pisces your your message is here it is the last week of August I want to say thank you for being here Ooh, Pisces and um, thank you so much for the wonderful support I am advising you Pisces to go back and check out the monthly reading of August to see how did that affect you whether or not the energy of this 2019 August affect you or the energy of 2018 August affect you so listen to both of the readings and see which one affect you always remember to use the on-demand link because the on-demand link that is how you know whether or not uh, the information affect you or didn't affect you okay um, the monthly readings are going to be coming out remember there's the on-demand link you can always order um that is one thing that is so good because a lot of people are saying with the on-demand information it's helping them out so much okay now mm, Pisces mm, Pisces bam 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 Pisces money is coming in this week Pisces okay it is a week of the hurt energy and of, of, of course when the hurt energy comes in which is the world card it is bringing a lot of success for you water sign people and for you Pisces so the ace the nine of Pentacles oh my god you Pisces this is so good congratulations so this week the central energy is all about money money is going to be coming in for the business people money is going to be coming in and yes I know it's the end of the month but that's not what it's all about see so nine of Pentacles is here and the five of Pentacles is in the reverse so obviously the universe is telling you whoever was having some hardship financial hardship money is here money is going to be coming back to you and money is here so I'm loving this because this is the central of your reading and this is the crowning so whatever the worries was about money it is over because the nine of Pentacles was the first one that flipped out and it's like two 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 came up a while ago and that is saying that you Pisces do not have to worry about your financial stability the week runs from the 26th until the 1st of September. Um, the monthly readings will be published on Monday. And there's also on demand deal. Go listen to the moon readings, download the on demand moon readings for the Pisces, because each and every sign has their own moon energy vibration um, extended reading. Go download that. That is good. And let's see what. Oh, Pisces okay you Pisces could be connecting with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this woman is going to make money for you oh my god you Pisces are in love with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn you Pisces are going to be returning to a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this person is coming in the nine of Pentacles came up and whenever especially in a love reading when the nine of Pentacles comes up that is telling you that um, you are going to be connected and what is happening is that a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn came back in your life or some of you are going to be finding out that you are in love with a woman 45 years and older she is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn there is a transition to your financial stability so um, it is as if um, some of you were having financial hardship and the financial hardship is going to transfer mere some of you could be dealing with a scorpion whoever the scorpion is I'm seeing a transition transition that is coming in some of you new love is coming in some of you if you were in a relationship with a Pisces cancer with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this person was out of your life they're returning I'm seeing you um, really um, protecting yourself you're ready for anything that is happening and you are uh, protecting yourself this is um, really really good okay now some of you were dealing with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra this person is in the reverse that means this person is leaving your life and now you're realizing that you are in love with an older person and this is 
the energy of a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person the lies and deceptiveness is over um, whoever was stabbed in the back this is now over a transformation is coming out God I love your weeks okay there is no major arcana in your week but having the energy of the ten of Pentacles in the center of your week bam 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 nothing can go wrong in this week okay because it's all about money for you Pisces okay it's all about money for you Pisces whatever the situation is whatever the energy is it's all about money for you in this week okay so whatever the energy is they are so funny I'm looking outside and there is a little um, Indian girl with a little white guy sitting down on the park bench outside oh my god okay that's so cute ooh ooh that's so cute um oh you know and this is what the world need mixed kids mixed relationships and this is just so cute Wow really okay back to the reading some of you wants a new start with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman this woman is 45 years and older she is um, you are realizing that this is the love of your life you're realizing that you have made a big mistake a huge mistake whatever the issue or situation is some of you realize I made a mistake I should have told this person how I felt about them whatever is happening um, if you were in a relationship with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra if you just got divorced um, you are realizing now that you made a mistake not telling someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn this woman is like 45 years and older and you're realizing that you made a mistake not telling this person how the how you feel about them and whatever is happening you're wishing and hoping that things could be different okay so there yes <laughs> okay so yes 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 some of you have regrets some of you wants a new start um, some of you are going to be having a new start in your financial situation is going to get much much better your financial situation is going to get much better some of you were dealing with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius this is more a Leo or a Sagittarius you were dealing with a Leo or a Sagittarius this person was taking every cent from you some of you fight to stay alive fight to stay um, financial stability, and now um, that is over because money. Oh, you're going to be um, collaborating with someone, and money is going to be as uh, some of you could be moving in with a scorpion. But whatever this is, some of you could be collaborating with a scorpion, or some of you are protected from a scorpion, also. Okay, so there is so much that is going on. So, yes. A new start is definitely going to be coming up for some of you with a Pisces can with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn some of you this new love that is coming in some of you are thinking to tell this person how you feel about them and it is yes tell the person um, some of you are going to be collaborating with a Leo a Sagittarius a Leo or a Sagittarius or Ophiosis you're going to be collaborating with this person it's going to be a transition it is a yes some of you who are dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius you could be receiving an offer some of you this could be an offer from a government organization or from something that was um, unjust it has to do with like like let's say there was some issues and then people realize that you saw what was happening and then they're going to be offering you a job yeah so like there was some really deceptive things that happened, and people saw what happened and but these are people in like big corporation and they saw what happened and they're going to be offering you a job okay energy of the towers the lies are now over 
the lies and deceptiveness are now over. Some of you were dealing with some lies and deceptiveness that has to do with a scorpion. So a scorpion created some lies and deceptiveness and um, you worked together with the scorpion, some of you, and they created some lies and deceptiveness and now you're seeing, um, you're seeing the truth. You worked together with them until now you're seeing the truth that they weren't honest so the lies and the deceptiveness is finally coming out and coming to an end and this is going to be good yes a lot of you is going to make money at work or if you work for yourself you are going to be making a lot of money there could be a promotion that is coming up for you at work okay so there could be a promotion that is coming up for you at work okay and this is going to be good if you have your own business you're going to be making a lot of money and if you um, were looking for a higher paid job it is going to be coming in for you I'm loving your reading you Pisces oh my god I'm glad I have so much energy because <laughs> sometimes when I get to the Pisces reading sometimes my energy is gone and um, in order to keep up the positive energy it is good um, I'm feeling really a good energy for you guys connect with nature another person another um, another group got this connect to nature whatever is happening connect to nature um, you are rejuvenating and inspired by spending more time outdoors so whatever is happening um, Pisces go spend more times outdoor this is going to be helping you in this week but it's going to be a very positive week for you Pisces I'm really really loving this week especially people who will have their own business money is going to be coming in um, some of you are trying to find um, strength to deal with a scorpion whatever the issue is with you and the scorpion some of you were trying to balance out your financial stability but now it is in full balance because someone has returned in your life this person is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn um, and this person is um, as returned in your life this is a new start in love for you and it is a yes go ahead with this person some of you need to tell this person it's as if if you were dealing with a, a situation where you just got divorced um, some of you have met someone quite some time you got divorced from um, an Aquarius Gemini or Libra and you um, you did not want to let you know this this person who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn could be a friend uh, you were going through some issues in your life and you did not want this person to know that you're getting divorced for whatever reason it was it it, it was a um, it could be a sense of feeling as a feeling as a failure how this person is going to look at you but this is someone who doesn't really judge you um, the relationship and the connection between you two is not something that um, you're being judged okay no but no one judge you what happened and 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 how this happened so um, no judging is is there so um, you know tell this person is yes tell this person what is happening definitely some of you um, there could be some legal issues where some injustice has taken place you stand to injustice and equality and people are going to be offering you jobs okay so yeah it's a good week enjoy namaste